Super Bank. This is your building. And you build exactly at your perimeter where your ownership stop. That's where you build your building. You do not improvise any space for your customers, including your staff. So it should be known to you. This all these park cars parked here are on public easement. And that is against our law. Alright? From henceforth, this cannot be a parking place for you. You look for a parking lot, a proper parking lot. Alright? Your customers can come. We can allow. Like this, this one park like this, you see? Two rows, if they are parking horizontally like that, two rows, only two, 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 two. If it is full, let the rest get out. If we come here each time, we'll say three for some standing parking over there, we're gonna tow them. And you will also receive your equal penalty. Because we are giving you, it's not your right, it's a privilege for the customers. We are saying your staff should not park here. That one is for certain. Yes, they're not parking here. They're not parking here, but customers are parking here. And that is what is causing um, unnecessary traffic build up on this road. And that has to stop. We are here to free up the road. A safety force. People must go to their destination A to Z without being delayed. The purpose of building a road force is to reduce the time spent on the road. What's the essence of having a pavement when people are spending 30, 40 hours within short period, short, 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 short distance, it's not allowed. So it's not going to happen. Here, two, two, three, two, finish. Tell whoever, if you like, you mark it. Apart from that outside, any car we found there, we're going to tow it, all right? This wall has to go down completely. Today, it starts from today. Clean up completely and take all the, the remains out, including there. Because this is the wall man is referring to. What now see you for any move your pocket there? Yeah. Huh? What do you feel to take off the, the blocking? The concrete? Okay. Yes, that needs to be cleaned up to the ground level, the you need to level it down. Where the totem was, was. Okay. Yeah. Okay. You see that? You that. that elevated block blocking needs to be flush to the ground, all right? This working, yeah. I want, we understand the, the, uh, when it all came it because of the couple. Yeah. In that we all abide. Public is out, all right? Every customer, we expect them to get in here. All right. Yes. So here, this one will not. It's not going to be here anymore. Okay. It has to be taken off and put. Uh, take your customers inside. And here we open it because you're going to break down this wall now completely where your building stuff. So here, open all these things out. We can understand this one. All right. We'll leave this one for privacy whatsoever. We we're, we're not discouraging that. But what we are saying, the walls, two walls. Close the totem and this one needs to be moved and your parking. Alright? And the parking needs to be communicated now. Let them start parking properly. My thought rock is here because if I leave when they start picking, you said manager just tell us like this and he didn't tell me we are picking. My thought rock is just behind me. Okay. Alright? All right. So I was telling them no car supposed to be parking here, especially their staff. Because this avenue we don't want to see anything. And the, and the, uh, be careful of this car. And be care and the, and the other one, this is Eco Bank. You see what they've erected here? They have a parking lot space there and they've taken about 30, 30 meters on the root corridor. Imagine where they did this against the drainage. If every property owner do this thing, you think we will have a road? We will not have a road. That's the deputy IG.
Mani is explaining to him about what they are doing in Karaba Avenue. And from their building, all this thing, this is about 30 meters that they, they've taken. So all needs to be clean up. Yeah, it needs to be clean up. Um, this is a public easement. You know, they did this, others do that one, do not have a roof. And they do this without no uh, permit, nothing. They just did it. So this is what is happening in this country. People build for the sake of building. They don't even know the laws that even go on there. And they don't want to ask. Everything is delivered. So we are heading, we're still moving towards over there. We started at uh, traffic uh, westway and we are heading. I have my junior team on the other side coming in. I am going. So we get, we're now heading for the, um, those areas towards the traffic light. Right? So that's why we are going. In the, in the event that I got up to the traffic light, right? I want to close up there, meet with these people, and tomorrow we we'll continue from traffic light to Fajara and then. Because it's all kind of bad. That's what it is. As we give our back, it goes back to where it So that is what has been done. Right? That means uh, we are not doing what we are doing. But what is important here is to ensure that whatever we square, we have a fight and we need to. Like I said, as far as the operator is here to stay, we must ensure that it stays. Otherwise, we are not doing it for anybody, we are doing it for what? In that space, we got a call of us. So, the issue here is we need to perform what we are doing and then we do it as it is required to be done. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Yeah, so we're sticking to your um, um, your directives as uh, a concern to all Gambians, even non-Gambians outside this country. Uh, that the place it seems the place that we clear, people are coming back. So wherever we clear stays, remains being clear. All right, and and free of the road parade. So that's why last week, throughout last week, we we started coming back. Started at the city corner, just one, and we will be visiting places that we play, and we intend to do that. So now, what we are doing, we will be uh, revisiting, monitoring, and arresting places that we clear, and uh, then two days or three days will be used for demolition. But thank God that demolition uh, in Combo here, that is the Greater Banjo area. Uh, the places left here, uh, I think, is this kind of avenue where we started today, and Banjo. So when we get into Banjo, uh, hopefully by next week, we will storm Banjo. When we get to Banjo, we hope to clear this city because it's a city of all, and that is where our pride is. The, the, the status of Banjo is very eye-catching. So it needs to be cleaned up. We will storm there by next week. Uh, we will do exactly where what we did. Uh, at the other places. So today we are here, we're still going to move on and see where we can stop for today, but it will continue tomorrow and so that we we'll finish Kaira Bavi and get to prepare ourselves by next week to get back. Okay. Thank you. That, that is understandable. What we have to put at the back of our mind, just to be mindful of dancing in the same place without making any headway, like I said, all right? What is important here, whatever is done, should be maintained. Should be made there and ensure that it is there rather than going back and forth. Okay? That will leave us nowhere. Right? So that's what is important. We have to factor that into whatever we are doing. Otherwise, we we'll just keep repeating ourselves. Okay? And at the end of the day, it becomes all futile. So that's the that's the, Because when it's futile, it means we fail woefully. Exactly. Right? And we are not here to fail. No. Alright? So mm. that's. Uh, Something that we thank you for the boost. Thank you, sir. We, 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 we are very motivated again. We are propelling to move on and we will finish the task. We, the way we started, that's the way we ended it. The same face, the same language, with the same strength. Yeah, because we have people like you behind us uh, who love this country. Equally, we love this country. That's, what, that's why we are doing it. Uh, and, and, and added to that, all the existing laws that are required are in place. Yes. It's a matter of enforcing or not enforcing the laws. So the choice is for us. Our task is to make sure that we enforce the laws 
So let's enforce it according to the law. Not outside it, but according to the law. Very important here. Okay? So all of us have to put that back of our mind that whatever we are doing has to be within the limits of the law. Right? Because where our right stops, that's where another person rights begin. Alright? It is not absolute to everybody. But that's your law. So we follow the law, we obey the law, we work according to the law. Thank you. Thank you, sir. All the best. Let somebody represent you. It's simple as that. One day How is the business? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, it's going slowly. Yeah. Thank you. We have a concern here. Uh, yes, our concern is those ranging poles that you install um, against your perimeter, serving as a, as a defender. That's for safety reasons. All right. Yeah. You understand what I mean? The metal, yeah, yeah, the metal, metal, metal range poles. Okay. All right. They're not supposed to be there because it's away from your your your, your building. Your structure, your ownership stop at the, the building. Anything outside the building is on the public easement. So these are the things that that is from here. Right? Yeah, all right. the all all the ranging poles around has to be out. Okay. Yeah, okay. but they they they're hindering the um, vulnerable road users' um, life, and it needs to be considered as one of the hazards on the road. All right. And the totem, we understand that you've already yeah, removed already your removed totem, one, yeah. but it's not completely because the the ground where it's placed, that is the pavement, the elevated concrete pavement, needs to be uprooted flat to the ground. It's still serving as a danger point. It needs to be cleaned up. That's why we stopped, stopped here. Your cars, we understand, even though we want to make it very clear, you do not have a right to park. There's no right parking here. If you want to do that, you need to uh, improvise parking from your perimeter in 2.5 to 3 meters where you can say this is our own. You can park anyhow you want. Hence, you build a defense line. You don't have any ownership here. Now, where, what we are going to do now here, your, we can leave this thing for the um, uh, customers. Your customers, because they are coming temporarily. Temporarily. But the vehicle, my tow trucks will be crisscrossing this road every day. If a vehicle has to be here for two, two hours, meaning the guy is here. Because we're not expecting your service to be slow as two hours attending one person. So any staff here must, be, must, must know they don't have any right to park here. And this kind of avenue is an issue. It is very narrow. People bring it, close it down. It used to be a boover, but now they close it. Where all these buildings starting from Westfield coming with the line that you are, you will realize after the petrol station, it has opened again. And this one supposed started from there up to Westfield, it was open like that. All these were compromised and they were all given a plot to officially to erect here. So hence you have that, you cannot add up another public easement added to your property. That is wrong. That's why we're here. So these ranging poles need to be uprooted. Uprooted. Not to cut, but uprooted. Take it all out. Plus the, 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 the elevated one, you take it out, please. And you park in, tell them the way they are parking is okay against your building. But staff parking for more than two hours, we will pick the car and take it. And we will not be blamed for it. Okay? Thank you. So how about the ones that are parked on the other side? This is not. This is the major highway that we are now. No, Our operation been... is across the board. It's all roads. When we come here and found out that even accessibility over there, whereby people will be parking, double parking, double parking, the narrow will come there and pick. If they are parking, staff can go inside and park there because you have less traffic flow over there. But it has to be in a manner it will not disturb the flow of traffic. Remember, this is an itinerary road that is here to relieve traffic from here. Whoever is living at this place, instead of getting there, you leave this one. If this one is blocked, the person will be forced to go over there and that will bring unnecessary traffic fill up. So these are the things that has to be considered. All right? Thank you. Thank you. So much good. Wow, lady, lead this boy. Concrete bit. It's called from technique. Go danko, 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 body. Ngeneko. Because you hang up on the phone. Fi, the bill and them good. Need muna nyo jar si kauli di ngay muya sa otomba mugani. So mortally water nekati. Ningen kogini. Dello and back to NRA. 
ngeen wax ni fan fi ngeen jox pour ñu dépass ñu arbitrisme gaay ñuy gene ni ci kaw yonde ñu ne dafa jigeñ ak yonde so dañ ñu wara jox ñu sport su ñu ne mu ne jox fi mu close sa sen building bi ñu def ko ko waye fele mu ta nek all right legi pour dit fan gaaw leen ngeen gene ko Alright, wall building. Lol do amasi dekabe, dekabe dekabe am lua, sarta yi lola nyo kwa, mun lo dek fi kapin tari wok so, wala ning a pagi yi lunga dek se bagasi yi lunga yi, fi mom lo fi, yo am bi kuri nyep la, what you gonna do is, pagal legi ni, ni la yi dek, buma yi wanyo ko, suma moto bangi na le, ya yi ji sto trofi, la fa nyo hi ke sel legi ni ko be pala nyo enu se bagasi yi yo buma, all right. This is a barbin salon. This is where we are stopping today. Please like, share for more interesting videos from Gambia this week.